Hello and good day. Welcome to our video channel, God's Promises. And today's video will be Luke chapter 22. Let's get started now. Luke chapter 22 describes the events leading up to Jesus' betrayal, arrest, and trial. This chapter begins with the Feast of Unleavened Bread, which is also known as the Passover. Jesus and his disciples prepared to celebrate this feast, but Jesus knew that his time was coming to an end. He told his disciples that he would not eat the Passover meal with them again until the kingdom of God had come. Jesus then instructed his disciples to prepare for his betrayal, telling them that one of them would betray him. This news shocked the disciples, and they began to question who it could be. Jesus said that it would be the one who dipped his bread in the dish with him, indicating that it was Judas Iscariot. After the Passover meal, Jesus went to the Garden of Gethsemane to pray. He asked his disciples to stay awake and pray with him, but they fell asleep. Jesus prayed to God, asking that if it were possible, the cup of suffering could be taken from him, but he ultimately submitted to God's will. While Jesus was praying, Judas arrived with a group of men to arrest him. Judas had arranged to betray Jesus for 30 pieces of silver, and he identified Jesus to the soldiers by giving him a kiss. One of the disciples tried to defend Jesus by using a sword, but Jesus told him to put it away and healed the ear of one of the soldiers who had been struck. Jesus was then taken to the high priest, where he was questioned and accused of blasphemy. The religious leaders had been looking for a way to get rid of Jesus for some time, and they finally found a way through false testimony. Peter, one of Jesus' closest disciples, denied knowing Jesus three times as Jesus was being questioned. This was a heartbreaking moment for Peter, who had been with Jesus from the beginning of his ministry. The chapter ends with Jesus being taken to the Council of Elders, where he is again questioned. They asked him if he is the Son of God, and he answers, You say that I am. The Council then decides to hand Jesus over to the Roman governor, Pilate, to be tried and sentenced. Teaching Application There are several important lessons to be learned from Luke chapter 22. One of the most significant is the idea that Jesus knew what was coming, but he still submitted to God's will. Jesus prayed for another way, but ultimately he knew that he had to go through with his crucifixion in order to fulfill God's plan for salvation. Another lesson to be learned is the idea of betrayal. Judas, one of Jesus' closest disciples, betrayed him for 30 pieces of silver. This is a reminder that even those closest to us can betray us and that we must be prepared to face this kind of betrayal with grace and forgiveness. The denial of Peter is also a powerful lesson. Peter denied knowing Jesus three times, even though he had been with him from the beginning of his ministry. This teaches us the importance of staying faithful even when it is difficult, and the importance of repentance and forgiveness when we do fail. Finally, the events in Luke chapter 22 demonstrate the importance of prayer. Jesus prayed in the Garden of Gethsemane, asking for God's will to be done. This teaches us the importance of prayer in our own lives, and the importance of submitting to God's will even when it is difficult. In conclusion, Luke chapter 22 teaches several important lessons about obedience, humility, spiritual preparedness, prayer, and the dangers of greed and pride. The Last Supper and the institution of communion serve as a powerful reminder of Jesus' sacrifice, and message of love and forgiveness. The chapter also foreshadows the events of Jesus' arrest and crucifixion, emphasizing the importance of trusting in God's will even in the midst of difficult circumstances. Thank you for visiting us today. Please share with us your favorite Bible chapter below in the comments section. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It really does help our channel grow. Looking forward to see you back here for our next video. Always take good care.